Abit, please come on the stage and tell us a little bit more about your project. Thank you very much. Great to have you here. Thank you. Brilliant. Thanks, guys. Uh, my name is Abid Jan Mohammed. I'm the CEO of Papyrus. I'm really excited to be here to tell you about our platform and our business, which we think is going to rev revolutionize the ad industry. So the ad industry over the last 20 years, or the digital ad industry, has been through two waves um, of, of inflection. So one was digitization in the early 2000s, and in about 2010, it went into a automation, or programmatic, as, as is the industry term. With programmatic came this. We thought initially efficiency. Over the last seven years, it's become complexity. There are a number of different players in the ecosystem between Coca-Cola wanting to run an ad and the consumer actually seeing the ad across mobile, desktop, video. And as a result of that, this industry has now grown to 229 billion, but there is, a, there is a significant amount of fraud, malpractice, arbitrage across the entire ecosystem. Um, the biggest advertiser in the world, Mark Pritchard, who spends $7 billion on advertising, thinks that there's about $2 billion of wastage in his, in his advertising plans. And he's driving this wave today, and it has to come from the brands and the demand side to change this, this ecosystem. So really, the ecosystem has become opaque. The supply chain has, uh, has a number of inefficiencies in it, and there are too many players taking slices um, through, that, uh, through that chain. So what have, what have we done? Um, so if you look at this, this is, you can see here, these are some of the big challenges. Um, one of the biggest challenges are you've got intermediaries. And those in the old days of financial markets are essentially brokers, potentially agencies, trading desks that are essentially take it, the, the arbitraging media. Um, you've got about six billion is lost in fraudulent traffic, so traffic that is essentially clickbait, um, click fraud, and also uh, traffic that's not viewable. Um, so a lot of advertisers are paying for ads that aren't viewable, which is a real problem, or aren't being seen. Um, settlement for publishers takes between 60 to 90 days. So massive cash flow issues for the publishers, massive inefficiency. Um, and then there's a lot of brand safety. You, you've heard all about the brand safety, you know, ads appearing against guns, against malicious content, et cetera, et cetera, and lots of brands are starting to worry about that. So what we've done is essentially we've built our own black, blockchain platform. And what we're really very simply trying to do is streamline the supply chain. We're effectively going to, we've created an ecosystem, and we're going to enable all the, ad play, all, the ad, all the players on that previous slide to effectively integrate into us, into our ecosystem, and we're going to use smart contracts to track every single transaction down to bid level and down to impression level, settle in real time, and bring back the trust, the transparency, which Mark Pritchard and a lot of the CMOs are talking about, and really kind of revolutionize the advertising industry using blockchain. We, uh, we raised the pre-ICO uh, in October last year of one and a half. We stopped, we paused, we built an MVP. Um, I've been in advertising for 20 years. There's a lot of players out there that sell way ahead of time. We've actually got, we've got a platform, um, and we're, we've built an MVP which enables us today, uh, and we're looking, we're in the process of driving traction with the ad, ad players, from the big agencies to the brands, uh, to the ad tech technology companies in the middle, and we're effectively integrating those people onto our platform now as we speak to start to run tests towards the end of Q2 and early Q3. So we will have pilots running on our platform at that time. Our, our product suite essentially incorporates three key elements. So we've got the integration tool. So that's onboarding all of these different players. And we're going to simplify that for advertisers. We're going to go and work with the biggest players, we're going to integrate them onto our platform. Some of them might even invest in our ICO, but we're effectively looking to try and bring, take all the thinking out for the advertiser by integrating those people. We've got a reporting layer, which is a campaign dashboard, which essentially allows advertisers to see in real time what's fraudulent, what's viewable, and, and what, how their campaign is performing through the ecosystem. And then we're going to use smart contracts to really simplify the settlement and every part of the ecosystem that today is causing issues for brands, agencies, and, uh, and, and, the, and the ad tech vendors. Um, so, very simply, we're bringing back, we're taking the, the industry through its next wave. We believe it's next inflection point, and we're taking it on a journey from, um, to bring back trust and transparency, which is ultimately where we believe the industry needs to try and be. We bring it, we've got big data scalability. So because we're building our own blockchain, everyone's heard of GDPR here. It's coming out in two, weeks, uh, two months' time. And that's causing a lot of consolidation in the industry. It's also causing a lot of players to start to behave better around data. Um, and because we built our own blockchain, we're essentially able to um, manage the, the, the volume of data that exists in the industry at, every, at bid level. 
Um, privacy management, so massive part of, what we go, of, of what's going on in the industry, who owns the data, the processor. Again, all of that will be permissioned through our platform. Um, less fraud, less middleman. Um, so ultimately, we're looking to create winners here. The losers will be the people that don't behave and don't play the game the right way. Uh, and arbitrage and do all of those things. So ultimately, we're looking to really simplify the ecosystem. And then really disputes. We're going to automate a lot of that dispute discrepancy issues that exist in the ecosystem, which today varies from anything from 10% up to 50 or 80%, depending on, on, on what it is. You know, we've, we've heard advertisers that say that 70% um, you know, of their advertising is not viewable. That's a real problem. right? So if, you're, if you're an advertiser and 70% of your advertising is not actually seen, what are you spending money on? Right? That's, we're going to simplify that entire process. So we've built a rock star team. Uh, we've got a great bunch of advisors, uh, from the CEO of Havas to Tim Brown, who is, who's now at SAP and has you know, been through this and been through the, eco the advertising industry for the last 20 years. Um, we've got a great team. Um, we've got, we're building traction. Uh, we've raised, as I said, a pre-ICO of one and a half. We're raising our uh, ICO of 17 and a half. We've got, we're in private sale right now uh, with uh, uh, we're raising 10 million in our private sale. Uh, the team's outside over there, so if you've got any questions or want to discuss it further, please come and talk to us. Thank you very much.